Hello from the IT department here at Vaughn College. We're here to help you set up all your accounts and applications. To get started, you will need a computer. It is preferable to be on campus since IT can help you if you run into problems. A smartphone, your student ID, which can be found on your enrollment and financial aid correspondence. We're going to start by setting up your college email account and multi-factor authentication, or MFA. MFA is a secondary method of verifying that you are you, and it does protect your account and privacy. So pick up your smartphone, go to the App Store, and download Microsoft Authenticator. Feel free to pause this video while you do that. It's very important that you install the app, but not open it yet. Great. Now that that's done, let's go to your computer. Go to https colon email .edu. You'll need to sign in with your username and password. Your username is your first name, a dot, then your last name followed by at vaughn.edu. Your password is going to be the student ID you should have handy, followed by an explanation point and the capital letters V as in Vaughn, C as in college. Again, that's your student ID number, explanation point, capital V, capital C. The next screen that pops up will tell you more information is required. Click Next. An additional security screen will now pop up. Under How do we contact you? Click Mobile App. In the next box, choose the first button, Receive Notifications for Verification. Last. Hit Setup. A screen with a QR code will pop up. Don't do anything here yet, though. Let's go back to your smartphone. Now is the time to go back to that Microsoft Authenticator app you just downloaded and open it up. Click Add Account. You will be asked what type of account you are adding. Choose Work or School Account. It should be the middle option. Next, you're going to use your smartphone to scan the QR code. Simply hold your phone up to the screen so the QR code is in view of the phone's camera. The app will now begin to do all the work. You'll know when it's finished processing when the next button on the page turns blue. When it does, simply click Next. The next page will ask you to approve a login, and you should click Approve on the bottom right. That's it. You're done. Just don't delete the Microsoft Authenticator app from your smartphone, as it will ask you to re-authenticate every 60 days. If you did accidentally delete the app or if you get a new phone, please contact IT so we can reset your account. We'll tell you when it's cleared and you can just follow the above steps again. Setting up your college email account and your MFA is going to help you log in to every app you need with something called Single Sign-On or SSO. This means you don't have to keep entering usernames and passwords for all your accounts. Let's go to the portal. It can be found at vaughn.edu. It may require your email and password this first time in order to log in. If it doesn't, you'll be directed to a landing page where you'll see a lot of logos, each representing an application at the college. This is what it looks like. We're going to go to Sonus Web, Students, Next. It will be your main resource, and it's here that you can do things like view your semester balance or register for classes. Please click on Login. You'll see a drop-down menu, and you will click on Student. It's the very first feature. On the next screen, you will choose Login with Microsoft directly above the blue Login button. You will need to enter your Vaughn email address and your Sonus PIN. This is only the first time though, so your Sonus and email accounts can be linked. After this, you'll get to skip this login process. Now let's go back to your portal page. Remember all those logos? Here you're going to choose D2L, which is orange. If you're on campus and you haven't logged out of your email, you should not have to enter a username or password. You should just be brought to your home page with all your announcements. Your classes will be seen populated on the left. The IT department at Vaughn wants to help you. 
If you're experiencing any technical difficulties at all, contact us at helpdesk at vaughn.edu. You should use your Vaughn email account so we can verify that it is you contacting us. If you're having trouble with your email account, then you should join the Vaughn Front Desk Zoom room. Ask for the IT department and you'll come face to face with a staff member that will help you resolve your issues. You can always feel free to reach us by phone as well. We want you to have a wonderful year at Vaughn. If there's anything we can do to help, please reach out.